Hello guys, welcome back to Fifi's World where cooking becomes easy. In today's video, I am going to make rice and peas in a crock pot in just about 15 minutes. The first step is selecting your rice. I am using two pounds of parboiled rice. And what I'm going to do is to wash the rice until the water becomes clear before I start seasoning my rice. And before we get any further in this video, if you are new to my channel, you are more than welcome to be a part of my YouTube family by hitting the red subscribe button. And also, if you like this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. To season my rice and peas, I'll be using scallion, thyme, habanero, and if you have scotch bonnet pepper, especially the green one, go ahead and use that one. Also, I'll be using some pimento seeds. Another word for pimento is allspice. Guys, I know this is not everybody thing, but that's the way how my mom used to make her rice and peas. She always adds some brown sugar, so I'm using two tablespoons of brown sugar. One tablespoon for one pound of rice. Also, you can go ahead and use whatever coconut milk of your choice. Next, I add some brown in for color. Next, I'll be using the Goya black bean. Guys, until you try this, do not come at me because this really saved time in the kitchen. I promise from I learned this, I never, never, ever gone back to use the regular peas. Like, who have time to stand up in the kitchen all day boiling peas or pressuring peas? when we can use this. Like, this takes literally 15 minutes to get your rice and peas done. So I use the black goya bean and it tastes just like normal rice and peas. When you try it, leave a comment in the comment section to let me know if you like it. Also guys, go ahead and add some salt to taste and then go ahead and mix in all your ingredients together until it's fully incorporated. So I don't know how to people teaching how to cook rice, but my mother tell me I'm push down my finger into the rice, and if it is one inch above the rice, that means it's enough water to cook the rice. And next thing guys, I'm going to add some butter. If you're watching your cholesterol level, by all means, skip this part. Next, what I'm going to do is to close the lid on my crock pot. So all I have to do now guys is just to hit rice and the crock pot and just allow it to take its course okay guys so moment of truth be mindful to open your lid away from you and not towards you so you don't get burned by the steam and guys look at my rice and peas that browning did bring out a color and my rice and peas is looking so shelly and nice guys thank you so very much for watching my video to the end and don't forget to like my video if you did like this video and also don't forget to follow me for more awesome content don't forget to share this video and i'll see you in my next video bye